Word Module 6, Independent Challenge 1, Merging Documents, go ahead and open 6-3, which is the dental letter. And again, the first thing we'll do is if we were to view this as one page, it's in landscape. So the first thing you should do is change the layout to portrait and everything should fit on one page. So I'll go back to 100%. And this is going to be a merge document. So choose mailings, start mail merge, choose step by step mail merge. And it's letters down at the bottom, start documents. Now we're actually going to use this document rather than saving it and have to go look for another one. We can actually use the current document, so it's a different approach. Choose next to select recipients. And this is going to be a new list, so type a new list and choose create. And again, we'll adjust the columns because we don't need all of those. So click customize columns. Title's good, first name's good, last name, delete company. Address line 2, delete. City, state, zip code's good. Country, region, delete. Home phone, delete. Work phone, delete. And email, delete. So you should have title, first name, last name, address 1, city, state, zip code. And we're going to add two. One of them is checkup. And then click OK. And the next one is dentist. And OK. And once you click OK, you'll be able to fill in all of the um, the records of, of each of the individuals. There are five of them. And again, to move from one cell to the next, just like you would in Excel, use your tab or access, you would use tab. When you get to the end after the dentist, click new entry, or you can press tab and it'll take you to the next row, a new record. So tab will work as well. And on the last one, don't press tab and don't press new entry. Just stay at the last dentist and then you'll click OK and you'll be asked to save the document. And this one will be called ILWD6 Dental Data. So once you save it, let's go back into it, edit recipient list, you'll have your list. And the first thing they'd like us to do is to sort by last name. So click sort and sort by, it'll be last name and OK. And then they want us to change the address of Mary. I've already changed it, but in order to change it, you have to click, because um, right now if you click in it, you can't edit. You have to click the source name, then click edit. And then you can go over to, and again, if you can't see it, you can double click to see all of it. And you'll correct, um, change her address. It was um, 987 State Road, and now it should be 600 County Road. And then click OK and yes to save and then click OK then we'll select the date and we'll choose insert the calendar third one and OK select your name the words your name and type your name good so right above we is where our, our address will be so go ahead and choose mailings address block everything's good click OK press enter twice this is the greeting line so select greeting and they want dear but they want the person's first name instead of mister or title and last name followed by a colon and if you want you can check to see how they look and then click OK and one more enter double click um, we need to go to write your letter I forgot to go there but you're okay so click double click check up Choose more items, select checkup and insert. Make sure you press spacebar after you close. Good. Double click dentist, more items, dentist, insert. You don't need a, a close and you don't need a space because it's the end of the sentence. And if you want to add that extra field with the first name, please call us. So I'm going to put a comma, space, and then I'm going to go to more items and choose first name, insert, close, comma. So it'll be first name, Rick. So please call us, Rick, if you have questions or to set up your appointment. I think it's just more personalized and I just want to show how you can use those um, fields. 
So let's continue with preview your letters. And if you wanted to scroll through them, and there's Emmer, so the names are there. Very nice. Go ahead and complete the merge. Edit individual letters, all and OK. And this is the one that's five, five pages. Perfect, dear Helen. Maria, please call us Maria if you have any questions. Save and submit this as dental labels uh, letter main. Great, thank you. And while you're here, after you submit this one, I'm going to go right to file because we're going to do labels. New, blank document. Go right into mailings, start mail merge, labels. And this one, they want the Microsoft. So let's just scroll up. And they want the second 30 per page. Click OK. And we'll use the same dental data source. So go ahead and select recipients. Use an existing list. Go to where you, you keep your, your um, files and the Delta data. And there you have it. Do your address block. Everything looks good. Click OK. Uh, make sure you update your labels. Go ahead and preview your results. And there you have it, all five of them. So then we can um, adjust this if we wanted to. So we'll go with um, edit recipient list and we will choose only the ones with doctor sign. So go over to the doctors, dentist, click that. And then you want to sort by city. So sort by city and OK and OK. And now you only have the three. With the, from the same with the same dentist so you can um, submit this one and the previous one so if you want to give that um, a name by the, the doctor the dentist name is fine and then if you go back to so save that one then go back to your recipient list and we'll go back into dentist and then we'll choose all and then you would have all of them so you can have two separate submits for that and then you can stop you don't have to do anything past um, past the letter O for instructions that'll be fine thank you